in India, um, untouchability, even in quarantine. Wow. Uh, Leilawati Devi agreed to cook food for people isolated in a school turned quarantine center. Two of the students stuck in isolation leave twice a day to walk home and eat and then come back to the center for isolation. Why would these students leave if they had a cook working for them in the center? They say it's because they will not uh, eat food prepared by a Dalit. This discrimination is happening all over India. Police were informed about the two students and think that maybe it's not discrimination. It could be an excuse because they don't like the flavor of the food. Hmm. Absolutely ridiculous. I think well, they, they weren't students. They were middle-aged Shabu, students. Speak louder and uh, as, yeah. uh, because your audio is okay, crap. So, so they, they weren't students. They were middle-aged men. Okay. And also people often think like it's the Brahmins who are like uh, very casteist against the lower caste and everything. But no, uh, Hinduism has made such a system here that those men were not like upper caste or something. They were also from backward classes. Uh, caste, but they were just not as low as the scheduled caste or Dalit, okay? Mm. Because Dalit, they are basically the untouchables, they're the lowest you can go. Mm. And they know uh, they can face discrimination from upper caste too, but they are also discriminating against the caste which is lower than them. Uh, also, this scheduled caste, I am fortunate, I am, my family is from this very same caste, by the way. And yeah, I mean, I didn't get to face much discrimination in my lifetime with this, all this, but there are genuine people who face lots of discrimination just because of the caste, because of the family they were born in. And also in Hinduism, you, they can actually justify this by the concept of karma. They'll just say, oh, you did something horrible in your past life. That's right. why you were born in such a low caste or something like that. Right. Wait, so you, you are from a lower caste? Yeah, I'm from the, the lowest one. The lowest? The wait. You're one of... You're, which caste? You're on the uh, lowest caste? The Dalit? The politically... Yeah, the politically correct term for the Dalit uh, the scheduled caste. And you're one of them? Yeah. I'm, uh, okay, so Hinduism. my understanding of Dalits is that they're not even... Considered the lower caste, they considered the outcast, like they're not even yeah, the caste untouchable. The untouchable. untouchable. Wow. So, but you live in a province that is like your yeah, province I mean, most Muslim. Yeah, isn't it, it? It's, it's, yeah, and not more Muslim. There are more Hindus, but it's a more secular uh, than more secular. Uh, the North Indians. Yeah. Okay, so that's why you haven't felt much discrimination where you are, but you have experienced some. There, there are some forms of discrimination even here because. Like after independence, the Indian government and the constitution mentioned that the lower caste would get certain privileges, like uh, there would be some forms of reservations for a certain amount of people in colleges and jobs and everything. So mm. the upper caste are like, oh, you're getting reservations, you're not even working hard. And those things, I did have to hear those things because of the caste. They, they'll but, just say, you are just here with us because you've got reservations. Right. But if you were in a different province in India, you would experience a lot more discrimination? Yes. Is that what you're saying? Yeah, there are provinces like Uttar Pradesh. This, this very, uh, the state where this happened is Uttar Pradesh, which is, I always mm. say, the most Hindu state. And by the way, fun fact here, the district where this happened is the district where Buddha supposedly died. Oh. So here's an interesting, here's a um, one thing to consider. When we're saying like discrimination against untouchables, the lowest caste or outcasts in India, people are like, oh yeah, that's a problem. But what you don't understand, like we're talking about levels of racism or bigotry, mm -hmm. the numbers are huge. Like we're not just talking about just another country, okay? We're talking about millions of people being affected by this, okay? Every, I feel like in, when, every time we talk about India or China, people need to understand that the numbers of, of people affected by these views or policies is astronomically higher than if you're talking about like, I don't know, Canada or Belgium or something like that. So th this kind of nonsense is, is really, really hurting people. And this is why it's really pisses me off when people say like, oh, Hinduism is not as bad or like it doesn't hurt that many people. Like you have, I don't know, like the whole idea of karma and caste system, people are like, oh, Hinduism is a way of life. It's not a religion. 
um, it's a it's a philosophy. It's not you know it doesn't have that many problematic things. And the, when you point to the caste system or karma, people are like, oh, that's you know that some people say that's not Hinduism, but you can't get more Hinduism than than caste and karma. Like you, you know, the, Hinduism is certainly probably the only religion which still supports caste. That still supports caste system, yeah. Um, By the way, actually, like, hmm, go, go, ahead. go ahead. You no, you go ahead. Uh, what I was saying is like, uh, first of all, it's of course it's like 1.37 billion population in India. So even a small percentage is like millions of people. That's one thing. But then again, most, I mean, a huge number of cases about racism, casteism, and other forms of bigotry are not even reported. For example, in the West, let's say UK or the US, uh, one black person was being was discriminated against and it would be huge news, right? Mm. In India, it's so normalized, it's so normalized in the society that people are like, oh, this is basically normal. What's new in this? No so Sharon, reported. Sharon is asking, aren't they, aren't they the same ethnicity? You can't tell the cats by looking at them, can you? Yes, you can. Hmm. Well, um, in some cases, because like uh, darker skins are often lower caste and everything, fair skins are higher caste. So, like, so you just, just say, you say, you, let me yeah. just say what you just said because your audio is crap. Uh, you just said darker skin people are lower caste and whiter skin people yeah. are upper caste. It is, it is often the case, although it's not like this, this is not like the uh, absolute thing. There are uh, darker skin. There are people in upper caste with dark skin and uh, mm. vice versa. But this is yeah, usually the case. Also, yeah. people usually in India, people just go and ask their full names and their surnames usually reveal the caste. Uh, oh yeah, surname. So people, you could tell people's cast by um, anyway, by the yeah. Also, but it is uh, based on blood, isn't it? Like it's based on blood. It's based on it's hereditary. You, like, you cannot you cannot change your cast. Uh, you cannot change you your cast. your parents. So you cannot also, change your you cannot leave your cast. You will always be yeah. condemned to be lower cast if you. But he, this is why um, this is what Muslims used um, to convert a lot of Hindus to Islam by going to the lower caste people and telling them, look, in Islam, everybody is equal. So look at what your religion is treating you like dirt. But if you switch from Hinduism to Islam, you will become equal to all your uh, Muslim brothers and sisters. So why doesn't not? Work in India. Doesn't work doesn't work in India. Right. Because in India, uh, your religion doesn't match. Everyone has a caste. Everyone Probably has a caste. One, one, yeah, one, of the, one of the two middle-aged men we talked about in the news one, uh, one of their name was Ahmad, probably a Muslim. I don't know, but they have a cast. So you could claim that you, you, the caste doesn't apply to you because you're Muslim now. But in, in India, is like no, 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 no. You will you always be, you will always be untouchable to us, no matter what you call yourself. Yeah. Because you were born in that family. <laughs> right. You were born in that family. Can... <laughs> right. All I can think of is the MC Hammer song. Da na na na, da na, da na. Can't touch oh, this. Oh, <laughs> oh wow! I, mean, I wanted to, I wanted to say that people That's... often uh, criticize the caste, only the caste system as a form of bigotry in Hinduism. But the caste system is not the only one. There are several other systems in Hinduism right. which can lead to bigotry. Several other caste is like the most major one, which most people know here. Many other like both trials and everything. People, Imagine, I mean, those, yeah, yeah. Imagine if that song became their national, their rallying cry, <laughs> and they all, and they had, <laughs> and they all had the, like a protest, and they all had hammers, and they took hammers like it's hammer time. They went and attacked the upper caste people with their hammers, and every time they were smashing their heads, and they were like, it's hammer time. <laughs> By the way, to, I wanted to reply to Sharon on Facebook. She was like asking, where do orange people fit in the caste system? Uh, probably the gods, because there are few people in India who worship Donald Trump. A lot of Hindu, a lot of Indian Hindu apologists saying like, oh, caste system is not a thing anymore. We changed it. But, but that's ridiculous. Like, I mean, it's better than before, but it's still a major, major problem in India. Um, Jack is saying we need to get Shopam a proper mic. I can't understand yet. Yeah, I'm trying to re repeat what Shopam is saying. Shopam, I'm gonna, I'm gonna send you some of our 
Patreon money on PayPal so you can buy yourself a headset because and also because PayPal sucks in India. What? PayPal sucks in India. Sucks in I don't okay. Well, I'll send you some some of our Patreon money to you. So get get yourself a proper headset. Get one with a microphone like this that comes to your okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay. No, but seriously, please. Yeah. I have one gaming headset, but I cannot plug the audio port because the audio port in my laptop is broken. Okay. But I'm not going to get you. Are you trying to get Patreon money enough to get a laptop? Because I'm not going to send you that. You did that nice try. Nice try. <laughs> we don't have that kind of cash. <laughs> <laughs> like oh we give, we're buying me stuff I get, oh my laptop is also broken guys <laughs> like <laughs> no nope. um all right next news news thank you for joining us subscribe to our channel hit the bell thingy if you haven't i don't know why what has what's holding you back okay if you haven't subscribed to our channel why haven't you subscribed to our channel explain that to us please like bell <laughs> and also if you if you're not getting notifications and stuff because YouTube is not telling people that we have shows because YouTube is like oh this person told us that they want to get your shows right they want to get your videos but nah you we think is no and oh like oh they also hit the bell button but nah you guys are too controversial we want to show them mainstream stuff we want to show them CNN or cat videos or whatever. But even there are people like, no, we want to see Atheist Republic. And YouTube is like, no, nah, we don't think you want this. They're like, no, please show it to us. We say to you, we want to see Atheist Republic. And YouTube is like, no, we think we know what's better for you than you yourself. So to solve that, link, there's a link in the description, uh, which is to our newsletter. So hopefully some of our, we could email it to you. So hopefully you get some of our content that way. Okay. So yeah subscribe to our newsletter as well and share share our videos because you know we do get demonetized that's an obvious on every one of our videos so f that but we don't care about that anymore <laughs> but we also get deprioritized and that's even more damaging to us deprioritize what does that mean that means we're not we don't show up on the suggested you know videos on the right and all that you know on the on people's home pages and that's how channels grow unfortunately we can't grow so we need you guys to share our videos 